Hello world. This is a very upset and disheartening situation as we all know to sit down here in this beautiful sunshine in, uh, in the south in the Gulf of Mexico and realize that you can't go get in the water because um, you might get some sort of disease from toxic chemicals that are uh, being dispersed by the government um, to clean up a problem that they completely created on their own. Uh, I just want to know at what point in time are the people going to wake up and see that this is our responsibility to fuel um, the, the, the efforts to get this thing done, fixed and handled, as it is now. I mean, it's, it's, it's conversations between, you know, our president and whoever the hell these people are involved in, P, you know, BP, this Tony Hayward fuckhole. Um, you know, the simplicity of it is, is, you know, we, we all as American citizens are partially responsible due to our dependency on fossil fuels that this happened. You know, uh, it's it, it's not not our complete and total, you know, uh, situation to handle. But you know, at some point in time, we're going to have to bind up and, you know, and and unite. And it hadn't been done yet, man. I'm really concerned. It's almost like nobody gives a shit. And I understand people want money. They want their claims settled. They want these things. They want BP. Pay me. Pay me. Pay me. Way to go. I get that. It makes sense. But what else is being done? I don't, haven't seen very many, you know, arms linked in protest and. You know, people doing or saying or, you know, e even on top of that, you know, anti-BP anti, anti -BP movement. I mean, quit buying their gas. Quit going to their freaking gas stations. Quit going there and purchasing a damn Coca-Cola. Stay away from the stores. It's very simple. They have the money to clean this problem up. If they do not have the money to clean this problem up, our government will step in and fix it. And hopefully they'll be able to do that much quicker at a rapid pace and maybe listen to something that some of these other guys have suggested as cleanup efforts as opposed to putting a freaking thimble <clears throat> over a, a, an oil gusher. That's ridiculous. This shit's stupid. You know, as it is right now, they're still allowing this oil to flow at a, at a very generous rate into the Gulf of Mexico. It's not going to stop. It's not going to do anything besides continue to destroy the environment and continue and continue and continue to do this for generations and decades and things along, along the path. I have a, a, an unborn daughter that's going to be put onto this planet in October, and it makes me sick to my stomach to realize that what is about to happen is that she's never going to have an opportunity to know what it would be like to have a full life in the South on the Gulf Coast. That makes me sick. For anybody who sees this video and doesn't agree with that, you're sick, you're twisted, and you have no fucking idea what goes on on this planet. At some point in time, I really hope that all you people that sit around and bitch and gripe and do these things would bind up, say something, put your words in front of everybody, and let them see how freaking angry you are instead of sitting there. Oh, i got to go to the BP office and collect my claim. What are you going to do? Buy a Cadillac? What are you going to do? Get a freaking new phone? It's ridiculous. Do something with it. People, I see people going to the claims office every single day trying to juice money out of these guys. Do something. Go work and clean the damn beach up. As opposed to trying to get money on a daily basis for stuff that you don't need in the first place. It's like, you know, okay, I'm going to get a settlement from BP for $30,000 when all I do for a living is wait tables in a restaurant that I want to quit anyway. But then I turn around and I want to go and buy, uh, you know, a flat screen TV for my house. You wouldn't have done that with your crappy ass tips. You wouldn't have done that. You would have supported your family in the proper fashion as opposed to pretend that you've got money for 30 seconds. Get your heads out of your ass, y'all. Let's do this.